Okay, now it works. Kind of, kind of works. Yes. What are you doing here? Yeah, I can't see. I can't see the. Uh, no, no, I am Waylon, Brother Genitivi's assistant. When you first came in, I was was hoping that you had news of Brother Genitivi. Okay, he's not lost. Was thinking, it seems. Funny thing, my my another computer had like huge lag spike when trying to go to the full screen mode with the Twitch. I haven't seen Brother Genitivi in weeks. He sent no word. It's so unlike him. I'm afraid something has happened. Genitivi's research into the urn may have led him into danger. Most definitely, yes. I don't know. He was very excited when he left and said he would be back with all the answers. Perhaps the urn has been lost for a reason. I pray for Genitivi's safety, but hope dwindles with each passing day. I, I tried to send help, but some knights came from Redcliffe looking for him not long ago. I sent them after Genitivi and they too have disappeared. Well, they haven't returned and they sent no word either. I... I suppose that's possible. I, I... I don't know. After what happened to Genitivi, can you blame me for thinking the same thing could happen to the Knights? Perhaps I am just a pessimist. I hope I am wrong. Now don't ask me where they went. You'll go after them. And what if ill luck should befall you too? This search is a curse on all of us. Some things are, are not meant to be found. I know that now. So be it. All he said before he left was that he would be staying at an inn near Lake Kalinhard, investigating something in that area. Huh. I don't know. All I discovered from going through his research was that he was staying at the inn. Y yes, of course he told me, but I also went through his things to see if I could find other clues to his whereabouts. That's n not true. I told you everything I know. Brother Jimmy TV told us, t told me about the inn, and that's all. Us? <laughs> I mean me. There is no us. Bah! Why do I keep up this charade? I gave you a chance to turn aside uh? and forget you ever heard of Jenny TV and the urn, but you persisted. Now it has come to this. And trust they forgive me, I do this in your name. Aha, uh -huh, okay. Apparently, he is behind his uh, probably genitivis disappearance. Worship on dragon, dragon cult, cults. Interesting. Yeah, these old games are fun when they work, and if they work. Okay, some have, uh, someone has been ransacking here. Uh -huh, corpse. Few symbol of undress there. As you say. Six and a half hours later. Finally. I mean, we had been trying for an hour. 
get here. No, it has been crashing and crashing and crashing. I mean, I mean, this is really, really easy to stream. What are you doing in Haven? What are you doing? There's nothing for you here. No, you do not. I would have been informed if someone was expecting a visitor. Who? Perhaps revered Father Eirik will know of whom you speak. Unfortunately, he's ministering to the villagers at the moment and cannot be disturbed. Can't be disturbed. A revered father, huh? That's new. I wonder what this means. Yeah, it's because it's always uh, been us in Haven. We Chantry do not question female priest. Our ways are not the ways of the lowland cities. The urn is nothing but a legend. I do not know who Brother Jenna TV is or what he says. However, I'm sure people can convince themselves of anything. It's always been thus in Haven. We do not question tradition. You may trade for supplies at the shop if you wish, and I suggest you and your companions leave. Did it just get a lot colder, or is it just me? They are hiding something. Tis obvious, is it not? Come, come, Bonnie Lynn. Tell us, tell us where you've been. Were you up? Were you down? Chasing rabbits around the town. Come, come. Who are you? You shouldn't be here. I asked you first. Lowlanders don't belong here. It is begun. Interesting place. And now this works fine. I've never heard of any village out this way. Is this place even on a proper map? No. As you say. Now that you say it isn't on the on the map. Merchant. It shall be done. Describe the place you know only as home. No, I've never heard that name. Uh huh. I don't have much, but I suppose you can take a look. Spellcasting. Hmm. God, did these are really expensive. What are you doing? That's private. Okay, he's hiding something. Murder hobos, oh no. That's one of the knights.
are blessed beyond measure. We are chosen by the Holy and beloved to be her guardians. This sacred duty is given to us alone. Rejoice, my brethren, and prepare your hearts to receive her. Lift up your voices and despair not, for she will raise her faithful servants to glory when her... Ah, welcome. I heard we had a visitor wandering about the village. I trust you've enjoyed your time in Haven so far? Perhaps. But staying hidden means staying protected. And we must protect Haven and our charges at all costs. We don't owe you any explanations for our actions. We have a sacred duty. Failure to protect her would be a greater sin. All will be forgiven. Okay. Apparently, it's it's a fight. easier to find the loot and stuff. So I probably missed something in the chantry. Very well. So I need to return there. I shall do it. Brick wall. Just thinking that this is like a doorway but Yeah it's a it's a secret door, okay. Okay, brother Genetivi I presume. Who are you? sent you to finish it. You don't know how glad I am to see someone who isn't from this village. I... Oh, the leg's not doing so well and I can't feel my foot. <coughs> Thank you. That... That feels much better. I don't have time to rest now. I'm so close. The urn is just up that mountain. My research led me to Haven, and I have heard the villagers talking. I know the urn is here. Haven lies in the shadow of the mountain that holds the urn. There is an old temple there built to protect it. The door is always locked, but I know what the key is. Irik wears a medallion that opens the temple door. I've seen what he does with it. Well, he did wear it. Yes, that is your key. Take me to the mountainside and I will show you. It is not that far and will you let me lean on you? For the urn, any pain is worth enduring. Ah, oh, good. Help me up here. I'll try not to slow us down. Okay, now no, it worked. So I just missed the secret, secret door. Which is kind of silly. Why the, why do they, do they need a secret door if there, there's nobody ever comes to this village? Here we are. Give me the medallion and let's see if I remember. Yes, as you see it, it can be manipulated. Just like this. And there. A key to open the way. There are very few keys like this left in the world, but I have seen some. When you find the right combination, it just feels right. It is hard to explain. Now, 
Let's see if we can open this door. There should be a place to insert this. My destiny was only to lead you to the Ann. It was designed to protect the Ann from those who would steal it or do harm to it. Namely, the Taventer Imperium. Ages. I'm not sure. The legends were never very specific on that point. Only the faithful shall lay eyes on the sacred ashes. Death and misfortune await the unbeliever. The Maker's gaze has fallen on Andraste's final resting place. He weeps for his beloved, and his wrath at her betrayers endures. That is what the legend says, and the Maker may indeed watch this place. Read between the lines, however, and you'll understand that it is merely a simple truth draped in hyperbole and metaphor. After all, no one wants to hear Willie toiled for many a year to perfect the curious mechanisms that would send a sharpened spike up the arse of the unwary intruder. I think my decision to stay here was the best one, don't you? Um, yeah. I'll be right here if you need me. Now I need something to read. By the shifting skies of the Fade, this is magnificent. Two hours later. What's next? More magic.
check that it is down. Wrong turn. Dragon egg. The life drinker. Restriction blood me. Okay, so this requires another class. Someone who wants to talk. Stop! You will go no further! You have defiled our temple. You have spilled the blood of the faithful and slaughtered our young. No more. You will tell me now, intruder, why you have done all this. Why have you come here? You did this all for an ancient relic. Know this, stranger. The prophet Andraste has overcome death itself and has returned to her faithful in a form more radiant than you can imagine. Oh no. Not even the Tevinter Imperium could hope to slay her now. What hope do you have? None but the disciples may approach Andraste. She is not ready yet. When the time is right, she will descend upon the nations in fiery splendor, and all will know her. But perhaps there is a way to make up for your recent transgressions. It may be because I believe in second chances. All of us stumble through the darkness before being found and shown the light. Perhaps do all of us murder a whole mercy, village. Her greatest enemy will become her greatest champion. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm Father Colgrim. I lead the Disciples of Andraste. Atop this mountain lie the remains of the mortal Andraste. The urn is watched by an immortal guardian. He is trapped in the past and refuses to accept the risen Andraste. Now the ashes prevent holy Andraste from fully realizing her new form. They are a remnant of her past incarnation, and she cannot move on as long as they exist. The beloved needs to reclaim the ashes, to make them her own again. All it would take is a drop of her blood. Blood carries power, strength, blood knowledge. Mage. Blood mage. To it, all the power that is held in the ashes will be returned to our lady. This is so twisted. Speak of evil, I must destroy you. Why have you not done this then? The Guardian has foiled all our attempts to reach the urn. He keeps what power remains from the true Andraste. He knows the disciples, and we cannot touch him, for he draws his strength from the ashes themselves. Uh -huh. You could deliver our lady what is rightfully hers. Uh -huh. I could just imagine the Grand Cleric if she were here. Her head would explode, I kid you not. There is nothing but madness in his words. He is a fanatic, and a dangerous one. Be warned, he means to lead you astray. The rewards for performing such a service would be great, indeed. Max 
so you think I can do Many this. Many have been led here, but only you had the fortitude and skill to survive the temple. You were led here by Andraste's hand to do her work. The task is simple. I give you a vial of the holy Andraste's blood, and you empty the vial into the ashes. Whatever magic was held in the ashes will be undone, and our great lady will be freed from the shackles of her past life. I don't know if I like the idea of us helping this Colgrim. Once that is done, you will have earned your place as our honored sister. But I need that if the Colgrim You only need a small man. pinch for that. The rest of the power contained in the ashes must be returned to Andraste. The rewards will be great. You will share in Andraste's power and be blessed as one of her own. There is a great power contained in blood. Through Andraste's guidance, we have learned blood to mage. harness it. It can be yours blood in exchange for a trivial solution task, to everything. A vial of blood emptied into the urn. That is all. Great economy. This is for blood magic. It's by the there. chantry that was established by those that murdered the first Andraste. Why should you care what they forbid? This goes against all I know is right. I must treat you. But we you cannot so. allow you to leave here. To arms, my brethren! Andraste will grant us victory! Okay, uh. Do it to us. Again, it's so fun, fun to go to the places where, where your friends are casting spells. We are getting lots of weapons.
been my duty, my life, to protect the urn and prepare the way for the faithful who come to revere Andraste. For years beyond counting have I been here, and shall I remain until my task is done and the Imperium has crumbled into the sea. Ah, is it not? Then perhaps this is the beginning of the end. When my brethren and I carried Andraste from Tevinter to this sanctuary, we vowed to forever revere her memory. And God, I have watched generations of my brethren take up the mantle of their fathers. For centuries they did this, unwavering, joyful in their appointed task. But now they have lost their way. They have forgotten Andraste and their promise. No, our Andraste has gone to the Maker's side. She will not return. The dragon is a fearsome creature, and they must have seen her as an alternative to the absent Maker and his silent Andraste. True believer would not require audacious displays of power. When my brethren and I carried Andraste from Tevinter to oh, this okay. sanctuary, I already asked we vowed to forever revere her memory and guard her. I have watched generations of my brethren take up. You already know. Contains the remains of the prophet Andraste. What else is there to tell? You have come to honor Andraste, and you shall, if you prove yourself worthy. Uh, more tests. Still. You must prove yourself worthy. It is not my place to decide your worthiness. A gauntlet does that. If you are found worthy, you will see the urn and be allowed to take a small pinch of the ashes for yourself. If not, before you go, there is something I must ask. I see that the path that led you here was not easy. There is suffering in your past. Your suffering, and the suffering of others. I 
by the time you reached Chiani, she was uh, broken, brutalized. You he, were he too late. Tell me, Pilgrim, did you fail Shiani? Well, well, hmm. too hard on yourself. No one's perfect. Is there any religion that does not thrive upon guilt like a glutton at his lunch? <laughs> no? I hope not. Uh. Accept your failings, but do not let them govern your life. And what of those that follow you? Alistair, Knight, and Warden. You wonder if things would have been different if you were with Duncan on the battlefield. You could have shielded him the killing blow. You wonder, don't you, if you should have died and not him? I... yes. If Duncan had been saved and not me, everything would be better. If I just had the chance, maybe I... Ask your question, Guardian. I am ready. You are ever the advisor, ready with a word of wisdom. Do you wonder if you spout only platitudes burned into your mind in the distant past. Perhaps you are only a tool used to spread the word of the circle in the chantry. Does doubt ever chip away at your truths? You frame the statement in the form of a question, yet you already know our answers. There is no sense in hiding, is there? Yes, I do doubt at times. Only the fool is completely certain of himself. And you, Morrigan, Flemeth's daughter, what? Be gone, spirit. I will not play your games. I will respect your wishes. I wonder what the way he would have open. asked. Good luck, and may you find what you seek. Yeah, uh, and, and Morrigan actually was... Correct, he was some kind of spirit. Address the arrows. Yes, please. If I have a space for. Begun. Echoes from a shadow realm, whispers of things yet to come. Thought strange sister dwells in night, is swept away by dawning light. Ah, uh, riddles. Of what do I speak?
echoes from a shadow realm, whispers of things yet to come. Thought strange sister dwells in night, is swept away by dawning light. Of what do I speak? Love doesn't fit the moon. Strange sister dreams. Incest and dreams. Well, dreams. A dream came upon me as my daughter slumbered beneath my heart. It told of her life and of her betrayal and death. I am sorrow and regret. I am a mother weeping bitter tears for a daughter she could not save. I'd neither a guest nor a trespasser be in this place I belong that belongs also to me. Of what do I speak? I'd neither a guest nor a trespasser be in this place I belong that belongs also to me. Of what do I speak? I'd neither a guest nor a trespasser be in this place I belong that belongs also to me. Of what do I speak? It was my dream for the people to have a home of their own, where we would have no masters but ourselves. The enemy of my enemy is my friend, and thus we followed Andraste against the Imperium. But she was betrayed, and so were we. A poison of the soul, passion's cruel counterpart. From love she grows, Till love lies slain, of what do I speak? Helpful. Yes, Easy. jealousy drove me to betrayal. I was the greatest general of the Alamani, but beside her I was nothing. Hundreds fell before her on bended knee. They loved her as did the Maker. the broken sword and separates true kings from tyrants of what do I speak she wields the broken sword and separates true kings from tyrants of what do I speak? Yes, I could not bear the sight of Andraste's suffering, and mercy bade me end her life. I am the penitent sinner, who shows compassion as he hopes compassion will be shown to him. No man has seen it. But all men know it, lighter than air, sharper than any sword, comes from nothing, but will fell the strongest armies. Of what do I speak? Yes, hunger was the weapon used against the wicked men of the Tevental Imperium. The Maker kindled the sun's flame, scorching the land. The crops failed. And their armies could not march. Then he opened the heavens and bade the waters flow and washed away their filth. I am Kefer, disciple of Andraste and commander of her armies. I saw these things done and knew the makers smiled on us. of the world stretched towards the sky's embrace, veiled in white, like a bride greeting her groom. 
Of what do I speak? The bones of the world stretch towards the sky's embrace, veiled in white, like a bride greeting her groom. Of what do I speak? Yes. I carried Andraste's ashes out of Tevinter into the mountains to the east, where she could gaze ever into her maker's sky. No more fitting a tomb than this could we find. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. The debt of blood must be paid in full. Of what do I speak? An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. The debt of blood must be paid in full. Of what do I speak? Yes, my husband Hesarian would have chosen a quick death for Andraste. I made him swear that she would die publicly with her war leaders, that all would know the Imperium's strength. I am justice. I am vengeance. Blood can only be repaid in blood. Andraste's dearest friend in childhood, and always we would sing. She celebrated the beauty of life, and all who heard her would be filled with joy. They say the Maker himself was moved by Andraste's song, and then she sang no more of simple things. humans. Do you remember us? Where you came from? And what some of us still face every day? What happened? It wasn't really your fault. You were caught in the situation just like the rest of us. You have a great task to complete. I want you to take this. I think you hey, should have interesting. it. Interesting. Seeing you now gives me hope for all of us. Reflection, please. 
Of course, this is simply for 15 healing effects re received. Pretty okay. Self kind of mission. Alistar versus Alistar, and they have a two pages. He's taking a beating. Let's see, how should I actually work on this? They weren't even inside the spell. Star is not in, in any kind of good shape. <laughs> See those thingies over on the side of that huge chasm? I bet they're used for something. Maybe I should touch them or stand on them? Good as an incorporeal bridge. Are we supposed to imagine ourselves on the other side? This isn't the best time uh, to be thinking about no, this, but not, I not the best to time. Ask you. Chances are we'll be heading to Denerim soon. And when we're there, I wonder if we might be able to look someone up. 
I'm not talking about a friend, exactly. And no, it's not that sort of friend either. The thing is, I have a sister, a half-sister. I told you about my mother, right? She was a servant at Redcliffe Castle and she had a daughter. Only, I never knew about her. I don't think she knew about me either. They kept my birth a secret after all. But, after I became a great warden, I did some checking and, well, I found out she's still alive in Denerim. She's the only real family I have left. The only family not also mixed up in the whole royal thing. I've just been thinking that Maybe it's time I went to see her. With the blight coming and everything, I, I don't know if I'll ever get another chance to see her. Maybe I can help her. Warn her about the danger, I don't know. Could we? I'd appreciate that. If something happened to her and I never went to at least see her, I don't know if I could forgive myself. Her name is Goldana. And I think she remarried, but still lives just outside the alienage. If we're in the area, then, well, it's worth a look. Okay, now to, to task, task in hand. There's, there's a hint here. There's still the trappings of the lap. Okay. You have been through the trials of the gauntlet. You have walked the path of Andraste. And like her, you have been cleansed. You have proven yourself worthy, Pilgrim. Approach the sacred ashes. I don't have an option of desecrating them because it's stupid. 